something that companies will be able to access uh, yeah, on the on new portal which has been launched today. So definitely uh, these labor reforms are long awaited uh, and this is the first step uh, that uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi said uh, that has been taken for labor reforms. All right, uh, fair enough. Uh, thanks very much for that, Mehek. Now, uh, yesterday the telecom regulator had issued uh, reserve price recommendations for the upcoming Spectrum auction. The 1800 megahertz reserve price is raised by 10%. Uh, the TRAI chairman has called for an urgent auction of the 2100 megahertz as well. The stocks haven't uh, taken this piece of news lightly. Today you've seen all major stocks, all major telecom stocks seeing deep cuts. You're seeing uh, the kind of cuts that we've seen. Bharti Airtel, Idea, Arcom, all down anywhere between 2 and 5% each. In fact, we've spoken exclusively to uh, Sigve Brecker, the EVP and head at Telenor Asia, on what he makes of uh, the recommendations being made here. This is what he said. First, I hope that I come out with more than the 900 and the 1800. I really hope that I come out with the 2.1 or the 2100 also. Because that is the spectrum you need to offer 3D services. Uh, and it's, if you have a combination of this, I think uh, that is what the operators uh, uh, need right now. And the explosion of data demand we have seen among the Indian customers has just started. Uh, and that's going to continue into next year. And I'm not uh, uh, worried about uh, content, uh, prices of smartphones, the technology. I'm not worried about that at all. What I'm really worried about is the amount of spectrum. Because now all the operators are hitting the ceiling uh, already. And there is no way we can continue to offer those data services without more spectrum. So that's why we are urging the government to come out with new spectrum as soon as possible and not to do it piece by piece, but actually combine all these three different bands in, in one go. All right, so that's the very latest in the telecom space. We'll take a quick break. After that, uh, we will be back uh, to tell you about the latest happening in many other spheres in the corporate space and, of course, the global markets, which you're seeing are taking deep cuts right now. We'll be back with more. Do stay with us.